is why anybody would need an AR-50. What do you actually need one for? It doesn't say, our Bill of Rights does not say you Bill of Rights. You don't need one. Go, you it need says one. Bill of Pierce. Rights. It is our right. Our fa hundreds of thousands of men no, and women it, have died it. so we could have that right to own it. You're not answering my question. Why do you need one? Why does any to civilian need one? To protect myself and protect my family. Let's but, look through history. Right now, we might like our government, but you've got Cambodia, you've got Russia, you've got Germany. Right. So just to Governments go corrupt. Just to clarify. I wish, instead of sitting here and trying to get on the New York Times bestseller list, he would have done this when he had the option, when he had the presidency here. He was supposed to speak on behalf of our military men and women. I wish he would have stood up when the president didn't listen to him and he felt so convicted. And I publicly resign and bring these points out when they happen. How many lives would have been saved in Afghanistan if Secretary How many Gates, lives would have been are saying that it was inappropriate to come Why out are we this doing memo? this now to sell a book, book? Is what I'm saying. Why did he not do this when he had the chance as the I'll, Secretary I'll of ask, Defense? No, that's a good question. He is, especially when you look at relationships. You mentioned the marriage comment. Mm -hmm. There's a difference between conservative and liberal marriages. Conservative women in a marriage, while we are independent, we can stand on our own. We respect that the man is the head of the household, and therefore we don't have that tension. Most liberal marriages, they're kind of battling who's the the big dog in the marriage, <laughs> and you have that tension. And tension does not equal happiness in a marriage. Well, no, Where are your party candidates? Well, let's point this out here. That's what you, as a Democrat, would love for us to do. Well, sure. You would love for us to continue splitting this Republican Party up, wouldn't you? Wouldn't that be a genius thing to do? My my people run for their party. They stand up and run. Because Why they're all Democrats. Yours? Because so they're all Democrats. Okay, so Republicans, if we sat there and ran this Tea Party person and this Republican person, we would never win. And we might as well just give you over the keys to question? all three branches. You're not Republicans. You Tea Parties are Republicans, right? We are. We're conservatives. No. You're Republicans. Uh, we're conservatives. Wait a second. Wait now, a second. we're also libertarians. Which is what but, that survey but not showed. Not in the libertarian. Tell me about China. Does China have a lot of regulations on their business? I, I honestly haven't been there since '86. Okay, well they do. I, I they have they have a lot of these different things. And guess what? You can't see out your window when it comes summertime because it's so smoggy and full of it. So the problem is we need responsibility. You need, Take the government out, make the corporations responsible to the community they live in. That's where the mistake is so when it comes to Texas. China as a uh, you know, Scotty, she's got a point here. Once you start attaching that word to a six-year-old, he's stuck with it forever. Can't you call it you no? Know, Cootie transmission. Well, let me just point out, I have a six-year-old, and he already, unfortunately, knows what the word sex is. He doesn't know what it means. Yeah. But unfortunately, listen to music. It's not what does the fox say, and I can only take so much kids bop on my radio, on yes. my minivan, before I turn it off. I always so turn it knows. up when I'm driving around. But anyway, go ahead. Okay. <laughs> well, thanks to I'm sexy and I know it, and my son doing it, and gang on the minivan. Yeah. I'm sure you look hot. Uh, I, you know, I've said they know the word. I'm sorry, yeah. my children. I can't protect them from it. But this yeah. is wrong. You're looking at the kids and they're playing with a puppy. By the way, great PR move there. It's not like you don't have them out there, like, you know, <laughs> flipping through Playboy. They actually put them with a puppy. I mean, how do you hate a puppy? So I think this is very bad. Um, it's setting a bad precedence down the road. And if this was true, then every French man should be probably in sensitivity training. If this is how we're going to start, you know, talking. I'm just glad he was kissing on the cheek and not twerking. Mm, what do you think, Keith?